Hi there! If you are looking for a 5 minutes introduction to smart textiles, this is the video for you. My name is Christian Dalsgaard and I'm head of the Smart Textile Alliance. We are a not-profit organization founded to advance e-textile technologies through development of industry standards. In this episode, I will introduce you to the story of smart textiles and show where we are today with new wearable applications. The basic materials needed to construct smart textiles, threads and fabrics have been around for more than 1000 years. The same with the weaving, knitting and embroidery techniques. Electronic devices came out of the late 19th century industrial revolution. Museums began showcasing relationship between technology and apparel in the 16th, and the famous James Bond movies demonstrates nearly all verbal gadgets that we know today. It's however astronaut spacesuits that have been the driving force for integrating microelectronics into cloth. Through the 18th and 19th, more and more applications were showcased, many around biophysically monitoring. The development of conductive fibers and fabrics took off. The idea of smart textile was born when computer modules were soon into cloth. As a result of the miniaturization of electronics, the large chip manufacturers saw the opportunity to embed technology into garments. They supported demonstration projects and the idea of smart textiles growth in the zeros. From around 2010 and onwards, governmental organizations began to make huge funding available for research in advanced textiles. Researchers have been using different terminology for smart textiles during the years. It's based on the same idea, namely putting intelligent functions known from electronics into textile material. ASTM is the standardization organization that came with the first official definition and I suppose other bodies will follow that standard. ASTM defines smart textiles as a fiber, yarn, fabric or even end product with properties that change in response to mechanical, thermal, chemical, electrical or other stimuli from the outside. People are using synonyms like e-textile, intelligent textile, smart clothing or similar. It's fundamentally the same as long as we speak about apparel. In the non-apparel space, many use terms like technical textiles or intelligent textile systems. Today, smart textiles play a role in various sectors already. One of the most developed area is motion and posture capturing. These applications are used in the film industry, in virtual reality, in health and in sport. Some companies have worked in that space for years, starting out with camera recognitions in studio or lab environment, and now turn into verbal solutions adapting smart textile technologies. These systems can be used in the field and not only isolated to a specific studio spot. Muscle activity monitoring is another area where expensive laboratory equipment can be substituted with verbal solutions. Not only is it possible to measure traditional EMG signals from the muscle work, but it's also <clears throat> possible to get true insight to the muscle oxygenation and your cardiovascular capacity. The benefit of smart textiles is that you can understand your training on the right and not only in the sport lab. Smart textiles also find its way into a broader consumer segment to interface your mobile phone or utilize LED technologies in fashion, for example. To sum up things, Smart textiles include a wide range of technologies from material science, microelectronics, textiles and chemistry. 
Ambient computing and artificial intelligence now find its way into many new applications. Thank you.